Welcome back to the channel guys. Um, it's Thanksgiving week and Thanksgiving in Houston for car guy usually means Autorama, which is our World of Wheels indoor show that comes Thanksgiving weekend. Well, 2020 being 2020, we don't get to do that. I actually built the Ranger originally to put it in the mini class at that show. And after three years, or four years, two of which it got best in class, I decided I wouldn't show it anymore. And it's been just kind of sitting ever since. And well, I'm going to take the opportunity of all the shows being canceled this year to go through, redo it, and be dang sure it's ready for next year. So on the rebuild, we're going to start with the interior, which is stuck in about 2005. Um, tweed everywhere everywhere I want to swap to a Mustang dash which might lead to putting air conditioning back in it I'm not sure yet um, I'm gonna let's see we're gonna put a Bronco 2 gas tank in it and get the fuel cell out of the bed as well as moving the battery down on the frame um, we're gonna go back to the XXR wheels which are on the Mustang I just threw them on there for the heck of it uh, I do want to go an inch lower by Zing the front drop beams and taking actually one degree of camber out of them to go lower. Um, it does have Cobra brakes. Right now the rear end is a flip kit with a set of slapper bars. I'm wanting to go probably monoleaf and Caltrax. Um, completely redo all the lighting. Uh, the truck was painted in 2005 and I ha really haven't done anything with it. The guy who actually uh, painted it was a good friend of ours and he's the one that got me into the shows and I, I, I really haven't really really haven't wanted to do away with this paint job because he's passed away now but I think I'm going to just somewhere in a dark recess tape over part of it just to save what it once was um i do want to go lead foot gray you know black grill black headlights um lower i am going to be putting new doors on it i'm going to buy a different set of doors and put handles back on it because that's one of the main reasons i quit driving it um i did the v8 swap it's 302 iron gt40 heads ecam holly 650 uh, MSD ignition, uh, Shelby Tri-Y headers, a Jags universal radiator with a pusher fan that I actually made mounts for, um, you know, relocated oil, of course, uh, Explorer slash SN95 Mustang accessories, which is why I think I can get away with putting an SN style um, AC in it. Again, if it is just a drop in and plays kind of deal, that's what we'll do. Otherwise, um, I'll just leave it the way it is because it's a show truck anyway. But I'm thinking S95 dash and console. Let's fire this thing up. Um, it does have a C4 in it. I actually got it from my good buddy, um, that's a fan. My good buddy, Joe pulled out of his 67 Mustang um, yeah. so there she is running so uh, the first video on the rebuild is going to be pulling the interior apart so that'll be what I do in my next video and I will see you guys then please like share and subscribe and have a safe and happy Thanksgiving